Hello, everybody, and welcome to our last part of Alan Wake. Alan Wake. All right, so we're playing through the last DLC. Um, it would appear that some people that, that I said it might be it might be three hours, but apparently that's wrong. Um, apparently that guy, I guess he maybe was saying like if you went for all the collectibles, maybe. I don't know, but everyone else is saying it's the exact same length as all the rest of them. So that is pleasing. Previously on Alan Wake. <laughs> Let's do this. It's not a lake. It's an ocean. After saving my wife from the mysterious dark presence, I found myself trapped in the dark place. Imagination can be the enemy here. A nightmarish world that exists somewhere beyond the shores of our own existence. We're the one making all this happen. Just do what Zane tells you. Follow the signal. Is all this really coming out of my head? The dark place is playing tricks on you. I made my way across its ever-shifting landscape, trying to reach Thomas Zane. If you're trapped in your own nightmares, you're still going deeper. It's all in your head. You've been making it up. Really, wait. Your delusions are out of control. Get out of my head. Seriously, Al, you need to get a grip. You know reality's different here. See what I mean, Al? Ugh, I think I'm stuck on this side. Well, you're gonna have to find your way out of there. I'll wait. Just remember, you're still in the dark place. You know that, right? Now, when it's sink or swim time. Fine. Reusing I could areas. feel the pressure mounting. Barry was right. Time was running out. Everything I saw was a dark, twisted version of reality based on my memories and thoughts. Crumble. I don't know what I should do. I have to find a flashlight or something, obviously. What is this? This is new. Oh, man. Stop. There we go. I'm so smart. I had to accept it. If all of this was from my mind, then I was the one making all this happen. I was literally fighting myself. It was a moment of clarity. Aha. That is what I want. I would like a flashlight. Also a pistol if you have one. I'm just saying. Surprise! Oh god. That's pretty clever there. <laughs> when he said surprise. Oh man. See what they did there. Do I get a gun? I got some ammo. Probably be good if I actually had a gun. I don't know. I'm just saying. After finishing departure, I felt finished myself. All I had wanted was to save Alice. After that, a part of me had been ready to just give in and die. But I hadn't given up. Thomas Sane had reached me. I had run across a nightmarish landscape following a signal from him. He kept telling me I was sinking, going too deep. I wasn't sure if he meant the dark place or insanity. Perhaps they were one and the same. Paintings. I like pumps. Nuts, huh? Let's face it, 
We always knew this was coming. I guess, but I actually feel pretty rational, all things considered. Crazy people don't know they're crazy. That's where they're crazy. Hey, check out. You're done sinking now. That means he's just about caught up with you. You better go talk to him. Can I drive? Oh. I don't want to drive no Hummer anyways. In this economy, the fuel mileage you get, geez. Lots of fireworks here. Nice. Wake heard the old gods play. Music came out all wrong. It attracted the horrors. Punks and roll. Let's rock and roll. Like the Fourth of July out here. Oh God! It's like the evil Fourth of July. Nah, I'm just kidding. This is what it's like. Right here, Fourth of July. That wasn't too bad. It wasn't very hard. At least it's kind of fun, actually. I like how they reuse that scene to the core. Oh god. Whoa. See Al? This is classic you. Always get This is just a memory. Even your memories are complicated. Oh god. Uh yeah. So I guess you're gonna need to talk to Zane out there now that he's here. I'm just gonna, you know, let you know. Zane, you have done well, Alan. Now I can accompany you. You are trapped in your own dream. You must wake yourself up, but first, you have to reach yourself. The cabin. I had to perform yes, a reach around on myself. It will not be easy. Your previous work can help you. I still have some pages of your manuscript left. Do want, do want, do want, do want. Clear. Boat rock, rock, no rock boat, baby. It's very appropriate. Rock. I can help you reach it. But after that, you will be on your own. Rock. I can enter the cabin now. Rock. Platforming. You are facing yourself. The parts of your mind that are hard to control. You're facing yourself. This is not a fight anyone else can win for you. Oh God. Oh God. Platforming. Oh God. What was the point of that? I was glad to have Zane with me in this place. He knew the terrain, such as it was. But a part of me wondered if he was even human anymore after so many years in this place. Platforming. No. Oh God. Cabin. Ooh. 
The world was tilted. It was turning upside down. Weight was lost. He would fall. He couldn't tell which way was up. Oh God. Here, torn apart by oh God. Oh God. Do not want. Kind of stuck here. I'm getting out of here. The wind was picking up. The weight was too high. I'm too high. Jesus. You can't want me dead this badly. I'm in fact too high, <laughs> apparently. The storm was coming. Bridge. It's not a bridge. This is gonna require some platforming, isn't it? I will get all the platforms here and then figure out what I need to do. Does that say path? I gotta get on one of these things and go, more or less. All right, platforming. Take me to that path over there. Path. No, not you. Stop auto aiming. Okay, now I just gotta wait. Oh, this is gonna be a hard jump, isn't it? That's as close as I can get. Oh, come on! Come on! That's not even fair. Didn't think I could make that. Like, maybe the school bus isn't the best bridge to take. Was too hot. I am too, too high. Hot. It's just, yes. You can't want me dead this badly. Uh, I don't know if I want to use that one. I like this one. This one seems like it's taller than all the other ones. Why do they even put bridges up there? Yeah, I think I should be good here. I'd probably make it right here. Hey, buddy. It's all good, dog. Just step back. Take a breather. I immediately like this DLC better because this is just really cool. I would have to make my way through this whirling madness. It reminded me of the dark presence, just another memory, but it could still kill me. Alright, I gotta pick one of these things again. Man, this is intense. Okay, there's a path over there. Might as well just get that path going now. Why do I keep on auto-aiming down there? I guess I can't get that. Nah, that doesn't look like a bad one. Ah, I'll take it. No, I will not. <laughs> oh no, I landed it. Oh, wow. Hopefully there's a checkpoint somewhere in there. Wake was too high. Just another memory. But it could still kill me. I guess. Let's just see what it is. See if I can. I don't even know where the path is yet. What is this path? Oh my god. This is intense here. I actually like this DLC a lot so far. Platforming isn't really that bad, but it kind of can be. This isn't too bad, at least, so far. Rock. Oh god, that's a bad thing. Rock. I want that. I want that rock. Rock. Give me rock. And then there was rock. What? 
Oh, it's that one tree thing. This is sick. I'm inside the tree. It's to be expected. You're struggling to reclaim yourself. The landscape reflects that strain, but each step takes you closer. If you persevere, you can attain the lucidity that fends off the darkness. This is really good, actually. I like this a lot. Now that I knew what I was facing, the environment became even wilder and stranger. Like it was no longer even bothering to pretend that things were normal. <laughs> Before there was a bunch of rocks, now I got a bunch of rolls. Oh boy. I want roll. I want roll. Give me roll. Gosh darn it. really good there's that lighthouse probably want to go there I mean a lighthouse probably pretty good thing to have in in this game oh man but the world is just oh geez this is about to get real bad I don't even have let's go buddies and yeah, not you oh come on buddy Let's roll. Get it. Light. That's a good thing to have. Hole. <laughs> what? I like how the word just moved down there. It's like, I need to get out of here. What? What if I throw this down here? Well, I gave it a try. Oh, wow. The fireworks are in here. Ah. Get all those flares. I got 20 flares. Oh, I can actually. Aha. Game mechanics. Oh boy. That is, that is not where I expected the hole to be. But now we have infinite flares. I'm liking this DLC. Infinite flares. Remember this part? Oh, this, this is a, I, li I like how they revisit parts, but they do it so eloquently you don't really like feel like they're just rehashing old things. It feels like his memories are coming back and haunting him, kind of, you know, that kind of thing. I like it. Oh boy, where am I? I don't 
don't like those sounds. Hey, buddy. Hey, it's not what I was. Hey, you with the chainsaw, stop. Follow where it tells me to go. Ah, whoa. <laughs> I was like falling in perpetually there for a little bit. Not really. Perpetually means forever, and I was not falling forever, but. Was forced to run through a maze, hopelessly sprinting in the wheel. What? Oh, oh what? um. Oh, God. Okay, maybe I should probably run. Oh God. Oh God. Oh God. Stairs. Stairs do not work when you are on your side. Oh, what the? Walk upstairs. Use them like a normal person would. I don't know, I don't know what I should do. I have forgotten. Are these typewriter or you know like a? Oh man, oh man, this is deep. I don't want to just jump. That's pretty deep. Typewriter buttons, keys. Oh man, what even is happening? This is so insane. Get up the stairs. Here we go. Mr. Wade, can I help you with anything? Uh, you might want to help me. No. Where do I go? What? Uh. Oh god. Giant spools. I'm following you. Should I jump? Got nothing to lose. Oh god, where am I? What am I even standing on? What? I don't even know what's happening. Oh god. Oh god. What have I done? Oh god. Oh god, bank vault door open. What do... I just wanted to run up there. A little too steep. Oh man. Leap of faith. <laughs> uh, maybe I shouldn't have. I don't. What did I. What? <laughs> so I'm guessing I wasn't supposed to go there. Maybe I am, I just need to push it. I don't know. Like, I gotta watch my health, maybe. Oh, Lord. You better go now before it gets real bad. I think 
go up this wall. I gotta wait now. I don't, I don't even know. This is making me so confused. My head is about to explode. I guess I have full health now, so I should be able to make that leap of faith now without killing myself. Or should I even do it? Uh, that looks pretty damn far. I guess maybe if I wait until right now. Now I have to go here. Oh, no, I should not go there. Oh, my God. I wish the game would at least guide me somewhat. I know this is supposed to be like a maze, but making me take leaps of faith and then dying over and over is not fun either. Maybe I should have waited until the door was like a regular door. Okay, I think I might understand this a little better now. It's still rather confusing. Don't want to get hurt from falling, though. Now we have to wait, of course. Almost, almost. And we can start climbing about right now. Alright, so... I need to wait until this door becomes an actual door. Basically. I gotta wait until I can slide on this wall like this. Except for I went a little early there. Okay, definitely don't just jump down here. See how this is about to become flat? Not like that. God damn it. <laughs> I was like, ah, I can, you know, start to peek over. Jesus Christ. Uh, I think I understand this now, though. Of course, I said that last time as I died. See, you want to, you want this door to become an actual door. You don't want this becoming a becoming a hole in the floor. You gotta wait a little bit until it's easy enough to slide like that without getting hurt. Then we have this hole, which we should actually probably just jump now, because we're gonna take more damage later if we wait. And then we gotta wait for this to come up. I'll be able to start climbing about right now. Alright. Go through here. There's a hole in the floor. Don't go through it right now, obviously. There is a wall that we can slide on. Okay, I need to jump now, though. Crap, I think I'm way too late. Now I can't even get through the hole. Yeah, I think I'm way too late. Now where do I go? There's a hole there? I'm so confused. I, I don't even know where I'm at. Okay, hold on. I should go through this hole. Which hole should I be going and trying to go through? Oh, my lord, my... Uh, my orientation right now is completely dead. I don't even know. This is the hole we're going to be able to go through here in a second. I think we came through there, obviously. I'm pretty sure, so... Ah! Okay, now the vault is open... Oh god, oh god. Gravity is is still a threat. Oh god. Is this door gonna be opening as soon as I walk on it? Oh god. Oh god, oh god. An elevator? Sure, why not? Uh, next stop, Sanity. You're doing well. Keep going. 
It's hard to make sense of this place. It's a dream. This is a vast place, home to forces and beings that are completely alien. The Dark Presence. Yes. I don't know what happened to it after your final encounter. Is there any way out of here? Sometimes transmissions can be sent between worlds. You've done this yourself. But to actually leave the dark place, I haven't found a way. Ding. Cheap room locked. All right, well, we got through that part. Station. Not something I particularly wanted to see, but obviously I wasn't the one in the dance. Hey, I like that part better than combat, at least. Another memory made real. Blake would never make it. The insanity he was facing was already a part of it. In him. His own doing. He couldn't possibly win. He didn't even want to. At least the lighthouse was much closer now. I would have to make my way up there somehow. Boom. Oh, God. Run. Combat. Whoa, buddy. Hey, buddy. I can see you over there. I guess all the lights probably are in the right direction. Hit it, hit it, hit it. Yes. That's what I like. Oh no. I can go. Guess I didn't go to the light. Probably be a good idea. Does it say wife? I think that word over there says what? Now it says wire. What does that even do? My connecting wires. In order to make a bridge. Whoa, buddy. Yes, I saw you back there. I saw all of you. I have 20 flares. Might as well bust a couple. Oh, my. L <laughs> of course, you're right there. Why wouldn't you be right there? You need to slow down, buddy. Wire. Wire. Connect, connect the electrical system up here. Is that what's going on? And then I got started. I have a new light. I wonder if these are all the flares I'm going to get for the entire rest of the DLC. I might, I might want to conserve them a bit. Not a whole lot, but a bit. I do have a lot of them, so I don't need to conserve too heavily. Hit the button. I remember this part. Oh no. Do not like that. Hmm. 
I like that big old lit up bridge there. It's a nice bridge. I like that. I want to be on that bridge. I want to be inside that bridge. What up, dog? The part of you that is in control is in the cabin, dreaming and insane. I don't think I like that. Which is why I'm talking to you. If that part can regain control, then you have a chance of making it. But a part of you wants to give in. There's comfort in the oblivion of dreams. You represent the part that isn't ready to quit and die. Wait! Are you telling me I'm not real? So there are two of me? Yes. And the one you called Mr. Scratch, he's me as well? Zane, are you playing some kind of game with me? I How can you say that when you wrote that page about me and the clicker? It wasn't one of my pages. You directed me to it. You had Weaver guard it. Yes, she was needed, and you needed the click, but I, I am not. What? I don't understand. <laughs> I am not. Zane? I, I, like, how we're, Zane, I like how Zane's more of a person now. He's like, well, more, he has a personality. So. He's not just some weird op, op, this, uh, omnipotent thing. He actually has, has like, uh, you know, emotions now, it feels like. I like that. Ready for the boom. Oh, buddy. Chains stop. We're going really high up here. There's a bus. God, why would I do that? Why why would I do that? I I wanna do that. I want to do that. Do not want it to crumble. The bridge needs to stay in good health. Crumble that. Alright, we can get rid of that one. Uh, that's it, though. Ah, oh, boy. This is not cool, dogs. Y'all need to sit down a little bit, yer. I almost was on that. That's bad. Okay, no one throw anything at me. We'll fight it like men. Like you guys would know anything about being men. Bullet. Jesus Christ. Okay. I heard Zane scuba ing. Is he the light up there? It is very possible. Oh man, I almost fell off and then I'm also going the wrong way. And, uh. No, that's not Zane. A moment. I can help you here. Oh lord. Christ, dog, slow down. It's like learning to control your dreams. There's a connection. You were in my dream. Yes, I taught you. 
You fixed the foolish mistake I made with Barbara. Where's that lighthouse at? Can I still see it? Is it on top of that rock above me? I believe it's on top of that rock above me. Yeah, it's like right there. Oh, my shoulder hurts. Sitting in this position for too long. Rock. I love it if one of the words said rock, and then I, I put my flashlight on it, and then uh, Dwayne Johnson <laughs> appeared. You smell what the rock is cooking? Hey. Hey, bridge thing. Stop that. You guys are all dead. I said, I don't even know what I thought I said. I thought I said fix her. Or like fix, uh. I was like, what? Flash. Where is the flash? What the heck is that? I am confused. God. I might want to run from that. Help me, Flash. Oh, God. Oh, God, it's a dude. Yo, dogs. Go back up a little bit, you hear? I, I, I saw you. Don't think I didn't. I do like this flash weird eyeball thing. Wake ran for the light. It was pointless. He would never reach it. His life would be snuffed out just as easily as the very thing he thought would save him. Even with the light gone, all I could do was keep going. This reminds me a lot of Resident Evil 4 for some reason right now. This kind of area here. Yeah. I remember this part of Resident Evil 4. <laughs> see now, I see Alan Wake. Instead of memories of areas that he's been in before, now it's just memories of like stuff he's done. Like play Resident Evil 4. Hey, buddy. It's Dwayne Johnson. Finally, you've come. Dwayne Johnson is the rock, for people that don't know. I, I, I'm pretty sure everyone knows that. I'm so scared of the dark. Oh, God. Since we're being so frank here, Alan, and let me just reiterate how happy I am that you've had this breakthrough, I would like to summarize your condition. By all means. And please, just let me know if you think I'm being unfair. All right. Well, let's start with the obvious. The car crash. Untreated head trauma. All due respect to Doc Nelson, but he's hardly a neurosurgeon. I think that the injury has affected you more than you realize. Yeah, I, I have had bad headaches. Then there's your history of substance abuse, which, combined with your chronic insomnia, has resulted in hallucinations and extremely poor impulse control. That's a dangerous combination, one which your wife has unfortunately had to suffer from far more than you. I know. I know she has. 
I don't think I'm exaggerating when I say that you are existing in a state of all-encompassing denial. Your vivid fantasy casts you as a heroic victim and allows you to skirt responsibility for your own actions. It allows you to solve your imaginary problems and dismiss the things that truly trouble you. In your self-serving delusions, your personal problems are assets that allow you to save Alice, perhaps even the world. Dr. Harmon, I... I think that's spot on. I can't argue with any of that. Well, I'm sure I'm stating the obvious. I don't want to labor the point, but, well, um... No, no. I understand. It's important that I face it. Precisely, Alan. You've put so much effort and imagination into this self-deception, but what good has it really done for you? You refused my offer of help, and here you are. Did being so obdurate really get you to a better place? No. No. And did it really help Alice? Was this really the best thing for your wife? Probably not. Probably not. Why don't we find out? You know, I've been talking with her. There's something she wanted you to hear. Oh, hey. That sounds like fun. All I ever wanted was to help you, Alan. I ate all the shit you handed out and tried to understand you your ate shit. What? healthy white male drama until my life consisted of managing your never-ending crisis. I hate you for your childish temper and the arrogance and self-indulgent pride that undermine all efforts to drag you out of the hole you insisted on digging for yourself. I hate you for leaving me in the dark with that insane monster bitch. All you had oh, to do man. was act like a loving human being for once in your life and stay with me. Dramatic exit hadn't been more important than making sure I was all right. She would never have taken me. I don't know where you went, but that's okay. I don't want to know. I don't think I'll ever be all right. The only thing that keeps me from killing myself is the hope that I'll never see you again. Cool. Cool story, bro. Ouch. I, I just can't argue with that. I think I should stay here before I ruin what life she has left. I think this is a breakthrough, Alan. Don't really do it. Very proud of Don't you. do it. Don't do it. I'm telling you now, Alan. Don't do it. <laughs> Apparently, there are new collectibles, and they're video games. But I don't know. I haven't found any of them yet. I mean, this is my first time going through here. I never played it before. It was nonsense. I knew I had saved her. I'd succeeded in that, and that was all that mattered. What I heard in there wasn't the truth. It was just another toxic heartbreaker. What does that even mean? You heard what Alice had to say. Mirage. It cut deep, but that made me all the more determined to force myself to snap out of it. I didn't want to be that guy anymore. I had to make myself see the light. Uh. Do I jump? <laughs> I hope not. Can I get up here? Yeah. This is where I'm supposed to go. Tools. No, don't fall off the edge. No, no. What does that say? Trimmer. Oh, oh geez. Yeah, knew that was gonna knew that was gonna happen before I even jumped. Oh man. Whoa, that's a hole. Get inside the airplane. Get inside the airplane. Can they even get in here? Haha, <laughs> you guys are stupid. You guys are so stupid. Ah ha, you guys are so stupid. I don't even need to use my battery. You guys are so stupid. What is in here? Ah, I found a video game. It's obviously for the Xbox 360. Yo, dogs. It's all set on a
Hold on, buddy. Whoa, buddy. Easy schmeasy. Okay, let's go to where we need to go. Don't even know where that is. I see light. That's all I need to see, baby. Right, we need to pull out our different weapon now. Please give me some good tools. Well done. You have come far, but there's still a little further to go. You must take full control of your own mind. Reject all of the fantasies you have constructed. Yeah, well, I think I can do that. A lot of the stuff I've seen here is personal and ugly as hell. I'll admit it hurts, but it's not fooling me. I know it's fake. Good. You are aware. The part of you bent on self-destruction is not. But you must be careful just because you know the lies for what they are. That doesn't make the danger any less real. I'll make it. I don't have any choice. Here. I cannot come any further, but this will help you on your way. Thanks. I guess. Hey, let me tell you something, Alan. I know how your mind works. You screw up, then you start analyzing it, and before you know it, you start writing all these horror stories in your head. Don't you? Come on, I don't do that. <laughs> yes, you do. I know how it goes. You're a complete failure. I hate you and I'll never forgive you for whatever it was. Am I wrong? Oh, man. See? I know you. But, Alan, it's all in your head. It is. I love you. And I'm not going anywhere. Thank you. They kept coming! You guys are dead because you're fools. Hey, light, what's up? Oh, God, that's bright. I don't even need to hurt you guys. My light friend up in the lighthouse will help me. Don't even need to shoot. Oh god. It's all so down here, alright. I'm the one with the lighthouse. See? Buddy. Oh god, help me. There we go. Does this light heal me also? Oh god. Ah! So down. See, this is. I do not want this. You guys are just hiding behind this pillar. Oh, my Lord. Lighthouse. Help. Oh. Dude, come on. What the f Ah, well. 
That was the first time I died this DLC, I think. That, uh, I can't remember. Who knows? I'm back here. Oh my god. Couldn't you give me some kind of checkpoint? not done yet I forgot I didn't really forget I just m mistake you yes I mistake you clear hey buddy let me get to this light here and then you can attack me all you want Clear that. Oh boy. That's what I like to hear. Come on, boy, let's roll. I'm getting to the lighthouse. We're, we're getting near it. Clear out everything. You got nowhere to hide, boys. This is easy. I like this actually because the clearing is actually a pretty cool mechanic. Hey, lighthouse, help me out here. Shoot these dudes, I'm just clearing them. That's more fun. Light. I do like I do like lights. Alright. <laughs> That's fun. The lighthouse. I was relieved to have made it here, but I wasn't sure what was going to happen now. Whoa, I just heard a 360 startup noise. You guys hear that? That's what it sounds like to me. need to find this noise. Ah, well. <laughs> Zane had left me. I wasn't sure what the Dark Presence had done to him if he couldn't follow. But from now on, I was on my own. Still, he had gotten me this far. I would never have made it by myself. This thing was going to end. It wouldn't be long now. What? Wow, that's... I was surprised by the change of scenery, but not much. I was starting to understand the symbolism. 
the way the dark place flowed. Wow. It's gorgeous, Alan. It's something, all right. Bridge. That's not where it's supposed to go. Feeling kind of depressed here. What? So Zane's your new buddy now. I feel like bad. Uh -huh. This is ridiculous. You're not even real. That doesn't mean I don't have any feelings. Thing is, you need to get all rational here. Abandon your fantasies, right? Well, I kind of hate to say this now, but I'm one. Fine, you're abandoned. <laughs> Like this game. <laughs> Al, what I'm saying is the only way you're getting in that cabin is through me. It's one of those kill your darlings things. But hell, you're used to that, big shot writer. It was in everything. It was even taking the people Wake knew, turning his friends against him. They were all against him. What does it say about you? When you're this desperate to keep yourself from getting better. Here we go! I'm earning a 50% commission. You need to slow down, buddy. It's great that you first make yourself an imaginary hey, friend. And then you I can't even get along with that guy. Evil skills, Al. You're a master. Ammo, ammo, ammo. Infinite revolver ammo. Let's crack that writer's block of yours, Alan! Oh god. Yeah, you would be the speedy guy, wouldn't you, you little annoying bitch? Fucking crows. I'm a gangster dog. The one you threw a hissy fit? I didn't know you and your ego wouldn't take it. And because of that, you always got me killed a dozen times over. Be on the hell! Hey, buddy. Hit the wrong button there. I was trying to dodge. Yeah. 
Yeah, buddy. You done dead. Let us go into the house. Just like that, my mind was clear. Zane had been right. I could think clearly again. But I couldn't survive in this place the way he had, and I might not make it back a second time. Leaving this place would be hard. Maybe impossible. It wouldn't take much for my thoughts to stray again. It was too easy to get lost in the dark place. Before, I was ready to curl up and die, let myself slip away. But here I was, the yet unwritten future waiting to unfold before me. A sequel to Departure. Whoa. My name is Alan Wake, and I'm a writer. Dun, dun, dun. So it kind of sets it up perfectly for a sequel, but uh, who knows if they're going to make one. The game didn't sell too great, so who knows if they're going to make another one. I think they probably will. I think if they have the artistic uh, envision for it, I think they could make another one, definitely. Uh, who knows what they're going to do. So yeah, that was the second DLC. I think that was a lot better than the first one, definitely, and I think it was probably the best episode out of all of uh, all of the other like original episodes you know I like that a lot actually that's pretty good um, so yeah that's uh, that is it credits yeah so that's it got every everything done uh, that's all the that's all the DLCs obviously and yeah interesting anyways guys uh come back for the next let's play who knows what we're gonna do maybe persona 3 who knows um <laughs> so we'll, we'll see you guys next time see you guys then